All right, we've heard from dozens of companies, restaurants, service, industry, retail, manufacturers that can't hire enough workers right now. So Desiree is with a company placing workers in temporary positions that can help turn into permanent jobs. And look, once you get into one of these jobs, Des, and you do well, you work your way up, and next thing you know, you're, you're running the place, right? <laughs> hey, you could be right. You have to start somewhere. You gain that experience and you move up the ladder. And this company, uh, Pride Staff, is certainly helping folks do that. If that is on their list of goals, uh, certainly something they can accomplish here. Right now, we're joined uh, by or joined with uh, Lonnie Young. You opened Pride Staff just about a year ago. Yes. Tell us what Pride Staff is and how you guys have been doing. We have been doing fantastic. Pride Staff is a national company. Uh, we focus our attentions primarily on uh, admin, warehouse, light industrial. We also do a lot of executive searches, accounting, uh, engineers, things of that nature. So we've been open a little less than a year. We opened, I want to say, June 22nd, 2020. Okay. And uh, within that period of time, we've put at least uh, well over 100 people out to work. We've got 20 Great. clients. And right now, our biggest issue is people okay finding, them. finding people <laughs> we have a lot of jobs a lot of great opportunities mm -hmm. and uh we work with a lot of companies so finding people we have more jobs right now than we do people so uh, if you're looking for a job, Prize there, Staff is the place to come. <laughs> so there are jobs out there to be had. So it's time for people to get re-motivated, get back into the workforce. Let's take a look at uh, your offices here. Beautiful facilities. And you can walk into this location right here in Phoenix. We actually have a, a walk-in this morning. Yeah. Uh, so tell us, uh, folks that come in, what is kind of the procedure and process that they go through? And how do you find a good job that might be a good fit for them? That is an excellent question. When walk-ins typically come in, we take them through our um, front office uh, recruiting assistant, Andrea. She basically uh, introduces herself and then introduce prize staff and what we, we consist of. Mm -hmm. And so she has them fill out an application and start getting their information and their documents uh, so that we can verify their ability to work. And so once that happens, in a lot of cases, depending on the job, we'll put them on assessment test and try to... Uh, find out what their skill set mm -hmm. consists of so that we okay. can market them to some of the better uh, jobs that are available. Okay. So and touch on some of uh, your clients, if you can, and what those positions for folks look like. And we were also talking about pay earlier. You've kind yes. of had that discussion with employers that, hey, you know, you might need to increase your pay in order to attract some solid employees. It's really it's kind of like the old saying that you get what you pay for, you right. know. And so when uh, we have clients that increase their pay rate, it allows us to get a more accomplished applicant that we can market to some of the better paying jobs. So we have a commitment not just to the associate applicant, but the client as well. Mm -hmm. And we want our most qualified applicants to be placed at the jobs that's going to pay the best and right. pay the most. So. Um, we're committed to both sides of the party, which we like because it's a win-win for everybody. And when you have a, a what we call most placeable candidate, that somebody that comes in that has a, a unique skill set or a real good skill set that qualifies them to be a forklift driver or mm -hmm. welder or mm -hmm. engineer. So we just want to make sure that we dot the I's and cross the T's and get qualified people, kind of like a... a, a matching yeah. the dating like, service yeah, okay right right you got to find the perfect match it's true um, so when so how successful have you been since you opened you were telling me you've already placed how many people in really good positions we've placed over 100 people out on assignment in less than a year uh, we've won the best of staffing award this year we won uh, the five star president award all of these are just um, a, a testament to our staff mm -hmm. uh, and my wife, Melanie, who we're glad to have available with us every day. So um, she's the beauty and brains. She behind is it all. The, <laughs> the beauty and brains behind it all. Uh, and I'm really, really thankful to uh, have her a part of our process. Uh, our uh, Thomas has been with us since uh, since, started, since we said. basically yeah. started. Mm -hmm. He's fabulous. He lives close by. He mm -hmm. pretty much likes to uh, open <laughs> and close. Okay, good. Uh, so, so we're happy to have him. And we've had a walk-in this morning, so really quickly we have to wrap it up. Okay. Where are you located and what are your hours that folks can come in and, or reach out to you guys? We're, we're located right off I-17 and Glendale Avenue. Uh, we're open to the public. We open at 8 o'clock and we close at 5 o'clock uh, okay. Mondays through Friday. Okay.